The military life is about discipline, toughness, and getting the job done right. However, even the men and women of our military are human. And now that mental health is better understood, there are more resources available. In tonight's Those Who Serve, we catch up with an Air Force Staff Sergeant whose life was turned around by a program called Help for Heroes. When an F-16 streaks over the West Valley, to many, it's the sound of freedom. And Staff Sergeant Riley St. John is one of those responsible for keeping the jets in top shape. I am an aircraft armament systems technician, so I basically work with the weapon systems on the aircraft. He joined the Air Force right out of high school. I really just wanted to be a part of the military. I, I think I've always been a huge fan growing up of, of um, people who serve. While Riley was serving his country, he was also dealing with personal demons. I had several childhood traumas that were, they were hard to get over. He would drink to forget, which led him down a dark path. It was ruining my career, it was ruining my home life, you know, family, all that stuff. So um, that's when I reached out to get help. Fortunately, Luke Air Force Base has resources to help. Riley was sent to the Help for Heroes program at Copper Springs in Avondale. It's designed for military personnel as well as first responders. Through inpatient care along with group therapy, Riley was able to take off on a new path of sobriety. I've made a complete 180. And he wants others to know there are programs out there available. Don't be afraid. Just admit that you have a problem and they will help you. And 12 News is honoring the courage, dedication, and sacrifice of those in our armed forces. And we want to share the stories and photographs of those veterans who are closest to you. To submit your Those Who Serve stories and pictures for a chance to be featured on the air, just go to 12news.com slash those who serve.